one, it's Gigi of Gigi Eats Celebrities. Were you expecting anyone else? The recipe I'm about to make in front of all of your eyes is not the typical recipe like, say, I don't know, roast chicken and vegetables because since when do I follow the norm? I've been thinking about making this recipe for all of you for quite some time because one of the three ingredients in this recipe is a huge staple in my diet. And when I'm not eating it like a crazy monkey, I'm dreaming about it. I know that sounds really weird, but that's because it's so good. And it's such a travesty to me when people throw it away. I almost get the urge to go into the trash can, fish it out, and eat it. That sounds really gross and I promise I don't actually do that. However, clearly the thought has crossed my mind. <laughs> gross. That being said, when I eat out with my friends and family, they know how much I love this stuff. So before their plates are taken away, they ask me if I want it. And of course, I always acquiesce, duh. I also adore making this food at home because my fiance doesn't like this ingredient either. So when he's finished, he'll ask me if I want the rest of his. And you better believe I pounce on his plate faster than a tiger on a zebra. That right there is love. Speaking of love, this food loves your heart because it's very, very, very high in omega-3 fatty acids. You know, the good fat. You're probably thinking or even saying out loud at this point, it's okay guys, I talk to myself out loud too, don't worry. But you're probably wondering what on earth this ingredient is. Well, it's salmon skin. <laughs> and yes, I said skin. Sam and Skin and I have been in quite the relationship for the past, I don't know, 10, 11 years. However, there was this one time when I actually ran away from home when my mom tried to feed me salmon, but that story is for a whole other video. But anyways, the skin of salmon, when cooked of course, I'm not telling you guys to eat it raw because that would be kinda nasty, crisps up much like bacon would and oozes such delicious salmon flavor. And it's just ugh, the best thing on the face of the planet. Sex, salmon skin, people always ask me this question and well, um, you can answer that one for me. <laughs> Anyways, as I said earlier, I've been thinking about making this recipe for a really, really long time. And I figured I'd give it a try today because I found a very special product that I'm going to include. This product, Primal Essence Coconut Oil. Because I mean, you can never have too much good fat, right? Right here, I have Primal Essence's Garlic Onion Infused Coconut Oil. This company infuses all of their coconut oil with either sweet or savory tastes. And holy moly is it incredible in fact incredible is actually an understatement this stuff blows the top off of a dormant volcano it is so phenomenal i know you think i'm over exaggerating but i'm really not it comes in so many different varieties as i mentioned before and i've been known to take their vanilla sweet variety and dig a spoon right into it and eat it out of the jar it's so good it tastes like vanilla ice cream but 10 million times healthier because coconut oil as you guys probably know at this point is so good for you. But even though Primal Essence has a ton of flavors, which I will be utilizing in some upcoming videos, I'm going to be using their garlic onion variety because I believe it'll complement the salmon skin recipe I'm going to show you today. So let me show you exactly what I'm doing. You guys wanna know what the third ingredient is, right? Because I said it's a three ingredient recipe and I've already told you that salmon skin and this coconut oil right here are two of the ingredients. The third ingredient I'm using in this recipe, asparagus! Hello asparagus, how are you, you sexy stocks? Hello. <laughs> so I'm not sure if you guys can guess at this point, but I am going to wrap salmon skin around asparagus and drizzle this coconut oil right on top. Doesn't that sound awesome? I know you guys might be queasy by the thought of salmon skin, but I promise you, it is so good. So the first thing I'm gonna do is actually steam these for a couple of minutes, and then I'm going to wrap the salmon skin around them, about three stalks, and I'm gonna roast it in the oven until the salmon skin gets nice and crispy. So while that steams away, which I think it'll just take about three minutes, let me show you the salmon skin. Ta-da! 
<laughs> I'm lucky enough to be able to go to Asian markets where they actually sell salmon skin by itself because they know there are people out there like me who just love to devour it on its own. Have you ever had salmon skin hand rolls at a sushi restaurant? This is just its raw form. If you don't have the luxury of having an Asian market nearby, you can always go to your local grocery store and pick up salmon there and then utilize the skin. You can skin it yourself and wrap it around the asparagus and you still have the filet for another meal. Just to give you a closer look, I will show you what it looks like. Maybe gross you out a little bit too, but for me, I think this is so freaking good. Oh, thanks for the greenery. I don't know what this little shrub is supposed to do, but thanks. I love where I got this, by the way. I got it at Ranch 99 Market. This is salmon skin. Ha! So good. The great part about it is there's a lot of meat on it still. So not only will you get the delicious crispy salmon skin, you're also going to get a nice meaty salmon flavor because there's enough meat on there to really make it feel like you're eating a salmon steak in a way. Okay, as you can see, there's some steam coming up from down below here, and that is the steamed asparagus. Hello, hello. Now, as I said, I only steamed it for about three minutes or so because I'm going to be roasting this whole thing so they'll get cooked even more when they're in the oven. Now what I need to do is wrap the salmon skin around the asparagus. I'm going to take three asparagus spears here, wrap it around. See? That simple. It's like bacon wrapped asparagus, but it's salmon, quote unquote, bacon wrapped around asparagus. The salmon is making love to the asparagus. If you really want to go there, I'm going to lay my asparagus salmon bundles down on a broiling pan that's already been sprayed with nonstick olive oil spray. And then I'm going to put it in the oven. It's like they're sleeping. They're wrapped up in comforters. I'm gonna spray a little bit more olive oil spray on top so they can get nice and crispy. And in the oven they go. Now you might be wondering when this Primal Essence coconut oil comes into play. Well, it's going to be drizzled on top because as I said before, the coconut oils are infused with herbs and spices and they are extremely pungent. So a little bit goes a long way. I'm going to snack on the rest of these asparagus and dip some into this coconut oil. Okay, so let's try. Oh my gosh. This is just, this is just, this is just. I can't even finish my sentence because this is just. <laughs> Rub-a-dub-dub, -dub, asparagus in the primal essence tub. <laughs> <laughs> what did I just say? But it was kind of awesome, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> just like this combination, what? You have absolutely no idea how excited I am right now because it's done. It took about 20, 25 minutes in the oven and I did have to turn the asparagus and salmon skin bundle over so it could cook on the other side, but this is the result. Mmm, you see, it's cooked just like salmon. This is Perfect. Now I'm going to put a little bit of the primal essence on top. As I said, a little goes a long way, so I don't even need a tablespoon, maybe a tiny little teaspoon. Now it's got a little of the oil on top. It looks really good. I need my trusty little salt shaker because I didn't season this at all earlier, so putting a little salt on there. So I'm gonna try this. I've got the salmon skin and the three asparagus. I'm gonna give this a go. It's a really big bite, but my mouth can handle it. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna be making this all the time now. The salmon skin is just bursting with salmon flavor. If you don't like salmon, this is not for you. But if you do like salmon, hello, awesome. And I was so right about the garlic and onion coconut oil just complimenting the salmon so well. I, I'm, I, 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 I have no words. I'm absolutely 110% speechless. Okay, okay. I can at least say thank you all so much for watching this YouTube video. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also check out Primal Essence Coconut Oil. You will not be disappointed. I have a link to their website in the description below. See you next week. The salmon skin is essentially a taco shell. It's like a paleo taco shell. Crispy salmon skin. Crispy and delicious.